this is my homemade bike repair stand and I'll go ahead and show you exactly how I made it. The base is made up of two 16 by 24 inch pieces of 3 quarter inch plywood that are glued and screwed together with uh, 1 quarter inch wood screws. Uh, you want a thick base. If you use just a single piece of 3 quarter inch plywood it will flex and the stand's just not going to be very solid. I used a uh, flange which is for plumbing pipe. It's one and a quarter inch and it is screwed to the base with uh, nuts on the back side which are countersunk into the wood. This is what the bolts look like on the bottom side for the that hold the flange. The main post is one and one quarter inch uh, iron plumbing pipe which is threaded on both ends. I bought this at like Home Depot or Lowe's. When you get to the top, there's a 90 degree elbow here, and then a 10 inch piece of black iron pipe here. Uh, it's th threaded only on one side. So you, if you get a p longer piece, you just go ahead and cut it off. Now this is the hardest part to make. It's a piece of PVC T pipe. Uh, it's a uh, one one quarter inch. And I have it just fitted onto the pipe here and I have a small slit cut into both sides just a little ways into it and I have a piece of hose clamp clamping this on. This allows it to be tightened down onto the pipe and I can also rotate it around and then tighten it into position that I want. I took the piece of T uh, pipe here, PVC, and I sliced it down long ways on both the top and the bottom so I have this little half here. I mounted two hinges, one on each side down on the bottom and then on the top I mounted a latch and uh, so there's like one screw here and a screw under there and then there's two screws here. Now what I've done is I've taken a small piece of pipe insulation and just cut it to the length of the T here and I, I leave the, the little pieces, the plastic covering the adhesive there, just left those on. Um, so I can go ahead, wrap this around the top tube of the bike, then I just close this up, latch it, and I can actually put a screw through the little lock there, just to kind of make it a little more secure so that it doesn't like pop open while I'm messing with it. Uh, one thing I could do, I haven't done yet, is go ahead and maybe glue this in or use, uh, I can cut it down in half and maybe take some double sided tape and glue it and stick it into both halves there so I just close it. But I, I just haven't done that yet, but it's something simple to do. So this is my homemade bike repair stand and it's relatively inexpensive to make compared to what it costs to buy a park tool stand or one of the other uh, professional grade stands. Uh, go ahead and make it. Um, there's a link down below to a page with more detailed plans and a parts list. So go ahead and look for that link and go ahead and click that and you can see my plans. I hope this helps.